Hey everybody, this is James from One Step Ahead, and I'm along with Renegade355, and we are going to be bringing you the uh, best Ninja Fuse class that we have found so far in Call of Duty Ghosts. So I'm going to hand it off to Renegade, and he's going to tell you the class. Hey guys, how is how is everybody? Sorry we've been a little bit inactive for a bit, but uh, we've been having fun with Ghosts thus far, Just and uh, we have our uh, Ninja Fuse class set up for you guys. So, primary weapon, you don't want to have any... Just uh, take a combat knife because you can get an extra perk slot and uh, it's helpful for being stealthy and whatnot. Secondary, I personally like to use the MP443 Grok and I silence it uh, so the enemies can't see me on the radar, obviously. And this pistol's pretty good. It has high damage and uh, pretty low recoil. So I take neither a lethal or a tactical, but you could opt for a throwing knife instead of a secondary pistol if you're uh, more oriented toward knives. Um, we'll move on to perks now, so, basically, you're just going to want to use every single stealth perk. Uh, so, every perk there, every purple perk, you just want to have all of those equipped. It might take a little bit to build up the squad points to buy them, but, uh, you make sure they have all those on because they'll all help you, uh, hide from enemy, uh, drones and, uh, and whatnot, and they won't be able to target you and whatnot. So, pretty helpful. And then I just like to use support, and uh, just kind of a SATCOM and a weapons box could be helpful. A uh, good team support package. And um, last thing for your class setup is you want to make sure that uh, you, if you go to, if you press X, uh, you can customize your player. I'm pretty sure you guys know this. And you go to special. Um, you can either choose a concealed cobra or a, a ghillie suit. You want to try to build up to the ghillie suit. I think you have to do some kind of special challenge for it. Um, but you want to unlock the ghillie suit, and, uh, that will really mask, uh, your person, because he's able to really easily blend in with the grass and whatnot. And, uh, yeah, so we're going to go show you that in, um, a uh, private match right now, and, uh, we'll see you guys later. And we're back now. Uh, we have Renegade right here in the, uh, ghillie suit with the knife. And as you can see, he's, uh, he's got a nice ghillie suit, so he's going to go lie down in a spot somewhere. doesn't really matter where. Um, but with a ghillie suit, you want to kind of, like, find leaves around you, because, you know, ghillie suit is pretty much made out of leaves, or things that look like leaves. So, um, I mean, right there, that's just a really good spot in general, pretty much no matter what you use, what kind of suit you're wearing, uh, because of this bush. But, um, yeah, as you can see, he, uh, just lies there with a combat knife. You don't... Um, like hold a stun grenade or double tap Y or anything because that just it doesn't help it kind of takes away from the uh, ninja fusing um, you can hold out a gun but it's not really preferred so um yeah that's pretty much it for ninja fusing um, just kind of lie down a good spot with um, a ghillie suit uh, anything you want to say Renegade? Uh, no just good luck with uh get some diffuses and we'll uh, be bringing you guys ninja diffuse spots uh, at least weekly um, if not if not more than that uh, but we'll uh, let you guys know if we're not going to be uploading that week and uh, we'll try to bring them to you uh, best we can and as quick as we can Yeah, uh, we're going to be doing the ninja diffuse spots a little bit differently uh, for ghosts because there is no theater mode anymore and I'm the only one that records so, uh, Renegade isn't going to be able to record any of his ninja fuses, so what we're going to do is we're going to show off more than one spot at each, uh, at each, uh, bomb, but we're only going to have one, uh, one spot actually getting the ninja fuse live. So it's going to be a little bit different, but hopefully it'll be a little bit more in-depth, and so you guys can really, uh, understand the uh, ninja fuse spots and stuff. One more thing, um... Comment on this video to let us know what map you want to see uh, for week one, and um, yeah, we'll try to bring it to you. So, good luck with Ninja Fusing, and uh, see you guys next time. Also, uh, we're bringing on a new member to our uh, team. He's probably going to help with commentaries fairly often. His name is DCQ Base Drop. You may and, know uh, he, from previous videos. Yeah, I think he was in one of our previous videos. I, I believe he helped us and, do yeah. Uplink. Um, yep, he helped us with unplugging into a few spots, so, yeah, look out for him, he's a, he's a good guy, he's fun to play with, so, and he's Australian, so it makes it better, but yeah. 
right, well, yes, uh, next time for I first Ninja Tree Spots. Thank you for watching, and uh, stay tuned for more Ninja Tree Spots and more Squads Mode content, because that's a lot of fun. But uh, we'll make a whole other video about our plans with uh, Ghosts. Uh, again, thanks for watching, and have a great day. Bye-bye.